Okay, good afternoon, Coventry people, to our community in the UK, around the world, UN establishment, West Midlands Police Force. Well, the reason this is carrying on, because the juniors, using all this equipment, technology, Tony Chapman, the Ron Lewis's, yeah, the Gareth Adams, the Matthew Lees, Nathan Cranes, Michael Harris, the Ashley Maps, yeah, and the CCFC, CCFC linked football fans network, yeah, all trying to make names for themselves, yeah, trying to win money for themselves, yeah, off more football information. Yeah, that's why they think they're untouchable because they're using armed forces, navy technologies. Yeah, drafted in by Dave Leverage, Carl Keeble. Yeah, the miners are links, the armed forces links. Yeah, and the boys at SCS did it all before. Marvin Davis, yeah, ponced off my football information. That's why he moved to Shakespeare Street. Yeah, originally he's around the back of my mother's house, Chandler Street. Yeah, once, once I put that on social media, he moved further down by a Shakespeare Street. Yeah, where they've got their car mechanics are facing opposite the Rose and Crown pub where they've watched me going in and out of there yeah and doing the immature psychology yeah and hiding where Marvin lives hiding in the back of St Michael's Church graveyard linked ne next to State Park School yeah they've got fucking the Frosters who own flats above the Kentucky yeah on Rosegrave Road looking across the road to State Park School and looking again into the Rose and Crown yeah along the CRD Coventry Police are protecting them. Yeah, and these people want to make names for themselves. They're passing information on to, to all the fraudsters. Yeah, from all the areas of Coventry, my generation know who the fraudsters are. Yeah, the Froggies, the Frasers, the Dotties, the Bubbles. Yeah, the Jamies. Yeah, the Phil Rooneys. Yeah, they're passing information on to all these people. Yeah, and, and to the George, fact George Quinn's been mentioned, and I've seen him around Boyle Hill and around Wykin, walking his fucking dog. Yeah. Driving in his in, in sales van, yeah, along along with the, all the dormant association, yeah, they're all ponting off my full information, yeah. The Morvey brothers are linked to all because Stephen Morvey's younger brother, the armed forces boy, yeah. All the armed forces boy I've mentioned before, Steve Bailey, Marvin Davis, yeah, they're all they're all into cyber crime, yeah. And uh, Martin Lee, Matthew Lee, Scott Lee, Martin Lee's brother, linked to armed forces, along with Paul Sullivan, yeah. They're doing all, yeah, they're all doing cyber crime, yeah, and passing information on to their council council people on their on the council estates in Holbrooks. Yeah, in Willenall, yeah, in Stoke Alder Moor, yeah, in Stoke, yeah, and some of these fraudsters, because we've moved out of their council estates and think, yeah, think they're intelligent, think they've moved up in the world, yeah, think they're thinking they're mixing with the rich, yeah, I'm passing information on to the, to, the, to the rich boys and girls, linked to Dave Leverage, who drink in the Hollyhead, yeah, and passing information on to Amherst Crew members and to the NHS. Yeah, so I'm not knowing what's going on. So Coventry Police, yeah, can come and swoop in the area. Yeah, and the rest, Tony Chapman, Ryan Lewis, all the youngsters, whoever's doing covert operations, yeah, because there's no way of them getting out of it. Yeah, they've, 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 they've incriminated themselves. Yeah, it's gone on for that long. The elders have given their names away, whoever these amateur covert operators are. I've got no connections to these people. Never hung around with them. Never associated with them. Yeah, and uh, yeah, and uh, I want the minutes taken off them in the pursuit of crime. Froggy. Tall Fraser, Big Fraser, yeah, I know which one it is, yeah, to the fucking fraudsters, yeah, they shouldn't have fucking went there, yeah, doing, doing, sh shot away inhumane crimes in Coventry, yeah, trying to ridicule me, my mother and my brother, when these people, because they're doing cybercrime, yeah, they've got no intelligence to read papers, yeah, they've got no intelligence to surf the internet and pick their own bets, yeah, that includes the CCFC boys, yeah, so this is going on, yeah, they expect to sit here t today and tomorrow, Thinking I'm gonna wait for, my, wait, wait for me to get my bets on before the European Championship starts tomorrow night at eight o'clock. Yeah, Russell Evans is another one. Yeah, ponting off it all. Yeah, because these people have degenerated themselves with alcohol. Yeah, and their sex, drugs, and rock and roll lifestyle in the nightclubs and in the pubs. Yeah, and these amateur crew members, NHS nurses, and sector workers associate with them. Yeah, Mark or Blue Eyes and the Ashley Mapton girlfriend, good Rasha girl, is passing information on to Stone and Stanton Road. Yeah. To, to the Prismore, to Paradise, yeah, to the Indian network who do gambling. There's a gambler who lives on Shakespeare Street on past of the day. He used to go to State Park School, same near small brother, yeah. He used to hang around with a John Tamara, yeah. These, these, these are seen, yeah, in Annabelle Casino, trying, yeah, yeah, trying to be sarcastic, yeah, and the, the, the yeah, and they and the, and the, the play poker and, and do bets, yeah, at the Rico Arena, yeah. Elizabeth, old. Old, old lady, probably the same age as my mother, or older, yeah, she lives just off Clifford Bridge Road on the state, yeah, uh, off, the, off the back of the Star River, yeah, where I bumped into Billy Morrison, 
Yeah, these are desperate gamblers. Yeah, so I'm naming the whole people. Yeah, until they get off my computer, get off my land, get off my mother's property, get out of the fucking head. Yeah, stop using, yeah, neuroscientists and want to be psychologists, psychiatrists, mental health administrators playing games with people. Yeah, that's why we sit on Kirby Duty. Yeah, that's why we spawn on people. Yeah, that's why it's all ever spent. Yeah, because they have to try and get into people's heads. Yeah, for, for their programs to work and to try and get the trying to get the spine network to make phone calls to social workers to healthcare workers to the nhs to the social health doctors to the mental health administrators yeah it's a daily conspiring while ever spent exposed network exposed the local people yeah and they'll want heads to roll yeah in the police force the cid the fire service the council establishment and the sector workers yeah sally fivey goes around the uk yeah doing this to women yeah they use lesbians yeah yeah you get a kick out of autism and being sadistic, satanic, yeah, abusers, yeah, to women from all different ages and especially to pensioners, yeah, they have to maim pensioners, yeah, for, for, for them to be put into health care, yeah, they have to blind them, they have to deafen them, tinnitus, oreology, yeah, yeah, the, the aiming equipment at the, aiming equipment at their bodies, raiding, raiding at their bodies, so the dysfunction of bodies, and try and tell lies that the pensioners are, 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 are disabled, can learn, no longer look after themselves. Yeah, that's what we've been doing around the UK for decades and generations, especially in the West Midlands. Yeah, and I'm exposing their gang. Yeah, linked to hooligans. Yeah, linked to fraudsters, linked to doormen, linked to armed forces boys. Yeah, they've been doing it for decades and generations. And they're all, all their wannabe experts and professionals, yeah, in sector, in, in sector work, social services, healthcare, NHS, researchers, and the mental health administrators, sociologists, human behavioural scientists, psychiatrists, clinical psychologists. Yeah, and making money off all this research, which is now done by internet streaming technology. That's what I'm exposing. Yeah, and they think they can make big books out of it. The uh, biometrics, neuroscience, yeah, mind, body, and catching the mind, body, and soul of their targets. Yeah, and sending it to networks all over the world. Yeah, and, yeah, and training students, university kids, via lectures, via seminars, via Zoom conferences, internet conferences, yeah, and via word of mouth, getting people to log on to the secret websites. Yeah, that's what's going on this day and age. So TIs, Karen exposing them all. You, the ones who are technical, I've done it before. I've got some of the links to the people who were, who were intercepting my tele telecommunications, communications, internet data on my phone and on my laptop. Yeah, and it's come up with a couple of addresses in Coventry and in Rugby. Yeah, and there's some where Mark Sexton's involved and the hooligans, hooligans, it used to be hooligan, who Zinna Logan knows, who's whose girlfriend, yeah, works for Rugby Council, yeah, they moved to Rugby, they used to live, yeah, at 27 Village Street, yeah, and try, and the plastic wannabe hooligan, Stone Island kid, she wants to try to stitch him up, yeah, and you sit there smoking a fucking cannabis, fucking cannabis, yeah, and, and trying to do street theatre, yeah, while the board's opposite, the co-operators are catching it all, yeah, I know what it looks like, yeah, yeah, and then Dina Logan jumped out of the car on Christmas 2006, yeah, asking her friend, the rugby council worker, this lad's fucking partner, where is he, where is he? Yeah, and I'm fucking sitting in the front room saying, yeah, I know, I, I, I know, I've spotted her stalking me for many, many years. Conversation was all about me. Yeah, and so, yeah, this, this is what we do. We target people from all different ages to train their people. Yeah, well, we put, we put this people to, to put a mental health program on, trying to drop them insane, trying to turn them to angry, stressed out, and killing candidates. Yeah, so they use the mental health route, calling social workers, saying all oh, these people need to be put to mental health. Yeah, so we'll have to do the covert program, trying to wind them up. The overt program, we've used local people, neighborhood, neighborhood, neighborhood people, co workers, past associates to try and wind the people up and sound record all their conversations and all their body actions and body language. Yeah, then they, yeah, they, they, they try everything. Yeah, they try to say the people nutters, insane, psychopaths, schizos, or the vulnerable. They're not big enough. Yeah, they're not big enough compared to our, our people. These are people who volunteered to have their bodies captured, like Marvin Davis, all the drivers, co-workers at SCS, the eight lot pigs. Yeah, took six months out trying to get big, trying to get big lot turkeys, Callum Hegarty's. Yeah, yeah, and uh, the Matthew Lee's. Matthew Lee went off for six months. Yeah, then come back to the workplace. So what was he doing for six months? They tried to say he was working with horses. Yeah, it's all lies. Yeah, it's, yeah, it's just because because of the. Uh, They've reached the end of a tether with me, yeah? I've gone through the whole programme, yeah? I've never been psyched out, never been entrapped, 
yeah, never caused any trouble. Yeah, so that's all I know how the program works. Yeah, and they modify it all to people, different ages, different backgrounds, different education, and it depends on what kind of what kind of your persona is. Yeah, so they've had to map out everywhere. Yeah, they had to get information for local people, old associates, old neighbours, old family friends. Yeah, even family in some cases I've heard about two eyes. Yeah, to get to 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 model their program on each person. So they thought my mother was easy to target, and they're trying the mental health program on her. They're trying to pen, trying to add the care home program on her. Yeah, trying to put her, trying to send her crazy, uh, trying to dysfunction her body, her body, her, her body. Yeah, her bowels. Yeah, trying to blind her, trying to deafen her. Yeah, and and all the all town eyes about it all. Yeah, just to just to try and destroy my family and to take the house off her so that me and my brother. Yeah, even though I says at the end of the day we're trying we're trying to get our own properties. Yeah, they're just making sure our futures are destroyed. Yeah, so we're calling out Coventry people. That's what we're trying to do. Yeah, I've exposed it all, and I want Coventry police to go and arrest them. Everybody have a good day, so I can analyze it all. Yeah, and let's get these people arrested. Cover operators to the local people, to the fraudsters, to any volunteers they're using, to the co-workers at past and present SCS. Yeah, to the people that con that conspired with, with the sector workers, Martin Lee. Scott Lee, Matthew Lee, Marvin Davis, yeah, and the SES managers, Neil, Neil Hall, yeah, Max, Max Matthews, and any Paul Southern, anyone else, they've used Duncan Furby and all that for statements, witness reports, and phone calls, yeah, because I left there nearly two years ago, it's all historical, they can't use them, and I'll, I'll put it on social media, yeah, to highlight it all, to expose it all, to judge and jurors, to the UN, and intelligence services, to rest them all, everyone out.